What's going on guys? Skyle here back with a video and in today's video I want to talk to you guys about a new product I found on Amazon uh, which is pretty much a replacement ear pad for the AirPods Max or ear cushion for the AirPods Max. So let's get right into it. So just to start off I bought these uh, ear cups from Amazon. They are ear pads for AirPods Max. Uh, they're replacement ear cushions. I got the ones in blue but they have a few different colors as you guys can see here. Uh, they have black, blue, green, red, and it uh, looks like white. Uh, also has premium materials, so it's like a uh, pleatherish look. So it's not leather, but it's like a PU type design. Uh, according to them, they have luxury sound quality. So uh, external noises are dulled, allowing for a better better sound quality uh, to be focused on your ears and giving you the premium experience that you expect. Uh, these were thirty-five ninety-nine. I also got three dollars off. So. If you want to check these out, link will be in the description below. It'll be around 33 bucks, which is notably a lot cheaper than Apple's official uh, replacement ear cushions. Um, again, ones that are like these. So they have a few different kinds. So here's the one that I have now. These are around 65 bucks if you went to Apple now to get a replacement. So um, you know, if you want to change your colors up, if that's your, if that's your really main goal, then maybe this is going to be a great option for you. But uh, so. Just for context, here is the ear cushion right here. So it's a very fabric type design. So it has a fabric feel to it. And uh, yeah, so let's quickly open this up and uh, let's see what's going on. So on the back, it says replacement ear cushions for AirPods Max. It has it in Chinese lettering. Uh, pretty much everything I just read off about the environmental skin friendly design with protein leather, again, PU leather. Uh, the cushions are made out of different memory foam that's specifically designed for sound isolation and it's also designed for an exceptional fit and this is all in Chinese as well so if you want to read a different language. So here's the barcode if you'd like to scan it but uh, let's go ahead and check this out real quick. I, again like I said I got the ones in blue so here's what they look like and comparing the two the main observation right away is not only does this appear to be a little bit thinner than the official one? But you can tell it's a complete different texture. So while, again, this is a fabric design, kind of like a jean design, if you have a, a uh, HomePod, it's actually very similar to that. So you can hear that, as you guys can hear there. This, on the other hand, is a very soft design. So it's very similar to what you'd find in like the Bose headphones or the Sonys. Uh, it's a PU leather design, so it's very similar to that. It feels like kind of like a rubber design as you can see but the quality itself seems to be pretty great so there's a cutout right here for the sensor so if you take your headphones off it'll still work it'll turn off if you'd like it to but other than that this the, the quality itself of this ear cup seems very very nice very similar to Apple's official pair of ear cups now one thing to point out is that while both of these are very similar in design there is a key difference in terms of the mesh inner lining right here. So uh, as you'll learn in a minute, that does have a great effect on the sound quality. So while there is certainly some push through right here, so there is certainly some movement, it's not as flexible as it is right here. It, there's a lot more cloth right here. So it'll be difficult to see, but each headphone or ear cushion has a letter on it. So this is an R. So it's meant to match up, of course, with the lettering on the AirPods, so you know which, one, which side to put it on. So this goes on the right side, so that easily snaps right in. And then we could do the left side, just like that. So this is what it's going to look like. Not bad, no complaints there. So again, it's very similar to the original design. The only difference is that this is a more silky, smooth finish versus a rough fabric finish. So just for context, I've actually been using these uh, ear replacement cushions for about a week now and I've noticed that there's a significant drop in sound quality. So I actually initially posted about this on the AirPods Max subreddit group and apparently other people have purchased this and have experienced the same thing. Uh, while this ensures a nice rich sound overall, nice profile, I noticed that these, I'm guessing it's because of the more cloth right here, but the one thing, main difference is that the sound quality sounds less rich, less full. Uh, it kind of makes the headphones sound a little cheap. Uh, so according to the Amazon listing, as I talked about earlier, they claim to have exceptional sound quality. So 
they're advertising this product to be one that's on par or at least similar to these headphones or these ear replacement cushions. However, in my personal experience, I'm finding that not to be the case. I think it's a significant difference, uh, a huge drop in sound quality with these, especially if you're using transparency mode, you will notice it. Now, I will say noise cancellation sounds great with these. So if your only goal is to have a different design and you want to spice up your AirPods for cheap, this could be a decent option for you. But if you do care a lot about sound quality, I would highly recommend staying away from these, at least until they get these issues fixed. Now, I will point out that I did contact uh, Earrox, which is the company, and I was phenomenal. I was very surprised at how fast their support was. So they got right back to me. They let me know, hey, we're happy to send a replacement out to see if that fixes the problem, uh, which, of course, I said okay to. Uh, unfortunately, when I got the replacement, it was the same exact issue. Uh, so I'm guessing it's just because of the extra cloth right here. Again, I'm not sure. I'm not an expert in this. Uh, but as a consumer, I could tell you that there was a noticeable drop in the sound quality. Now, on the other hand, I will point out, if you have an allergic reaction to the these ear cuffs, that may be because of the fabric design. And I think I noticed, noted in a previous video that the AirPods themselves are pretty itchy around my ears. Uh, a lot of people experience that because, again, that fabric feel is going against your ears. Um, this will eliminate that entirely. So if you've had a normal pair of headphones at any point, in your life, this is pre going to be pretty much identical to that. Let me know what you guys think in the comment section down below. Are you have you purchased these? And if so, what do you guys think about it? Because again, there are some mixed reviews. Some people said the sound quality is not altered. In my experience it certainly is. Uh, but I want to hear what you guys think in the comment section down below. Is are you experiencing one thing or the other? And uh, if you have any questions, be sure to let me know in the comment section down below. I try to stay on there uh, pretty frequently. So have if you have a question, let me know. Also, if you enjoyed this video, it would be greatly appreciated if you gave it a thumbs up because it helps the channel out a ton. Also, if you want to see more content just like this, be sure to hit the bell uh, to get notified each time there's a new video, and subscribe for more content just like this. Anyway, thanks so much for watching, and I hope to see you guys in the next video. Peace.